So in this video, I'll be showing you how to change your mouse cursor. I know I've done this in the past, but this is an updated video for that. So what you want to do is go to the search bar and type in mouse settings and click on that top option. Then you'll see on the right side, there's two options, adjust mouse and cursor size and additional mouse options. Now we're first going to look at the first option, which is changing your mouse cursor size as well as the color. And this the color change is specifically for the default mouse cursors. So you'll see there's four options. You have the plain white one, then a black one, then one that changes colors. So if you go through a black um, surface, it will change white. And if you go through a blue one, it will be an orange color. And then the last one is whatever color you want to choose. So in this case, there's yellow, there's orange, there's purple, there's pink, and you can see the different colors here. And then you can just use the slider to ch change the mouse cursor size. Now I'll say that, you won't really see the change here because of the recording. I don't know why the recording doesn't properly show it, but I can promise you when you play around with that thing, it will change for you when you're um, using it. So it will be bigger. So don't worry about that too much. Next, we just click on additional mouse um, settings on the top right corner. So we can go back to where we were and then we click on additional mouse options. This is so we can now start changing the cursor, the make use a custom cursor. Then we click on the pointers tab and you'll see there's a whole bunch of different cursors. Each of them have various functions. So the one I'm going to be looking at here is the normal cursor and you want to be changing that. So actually, if you want all of them changed, then you'll have to do the following step for all of them. Okay. So after that's done, we're going to go to this website. I'll put the link in the description. And here's where a bunch of custom cursor, um, custom cursors are. And you can just test which one is the best. So if you hover over each box, you'll see what the cursor looks like. And you can just go for all of this and find the perfect one. Once you find the right one, you can just click on the link and then click on download cursor in the top right corner. Once that is done, you can just go back to that mouse property tab and click on normal select so that that is selected and click on browse then. Then you just go to where you downloaded your cursor and click on it and say open. Then finally click on apply and you're done. There it is, that's changed. And now you're sorted. You can use it as you want to and if you want to if you want to change you know the loading cursor the waiting cursor all of that you'll have to just do the same processes thank you very much for watching see you next time